Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be all about our chickens. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Allison. I currently post content on this channel surrounding our relocation from Canada to Nicaragua. If you're interested in that kind of content, the subscribe button is down below along with my Instagram and TikTok. Okay, so this is going to be a really quick intro to this video. I just thought it'd be fun to show you guys that we got chickens, especially for those of you who don't follow me on Instagram. I have wanted chickens pretty much my entire life and I'm so excited that we finally have them. I'm going to go outside and show you guys a little tour of the chicken coop that my cuidador and a cuidador down the street, the two of them together built it and they did an amazing job. I am just amazed by their talent. I literally just found a YouTube video of something that I thought would work well and asked some friends who have chickens, their recommendations as well. And I just showed them kind of what I was looking for and they just created the best chicken coop for me. And then four days ago, we headed out to a local farm and I bought 15 chickens. They are laying hens, so they just got to the age where they started to lay eggs, which is great, perfect for what we're looking for. And I only got hens, not roosters. Reason being because the chicken coop is literally right beside our house, so in an effort to, you know, not be woken up at all hours of the night and early morning, I did not want roosters. So we only got hens, we got 15 of them. And then they also gave us some fertilized eggs because I had mentioned in the future, we would be interested in hatching our own chicks as well. And they gave us a uh, like, an uh, incubator box that they had made and used as well to borrow. So we were all in, we started with both right off the bat. We have 15 laying hens, and then we have, I don't know how many eggs, maybe another 15 eggs of both regular size and mini size chicken eggs in the incubator, and they will be hatching in about 18 days from now. So yeah, I'm gonna head out there and show you guys the chicken coop and the chickens as well and the eggs. If you have any questions at all, let me know and thank you so much for watching. All right, so here's the chicken coop. I'm gonna do a bit of an overview going around the outside first. As you can see, we have half of it tarped. And then in the back, we actually have doors so that we can access the eggs from the outside without having to go in the chicken coop. However, <laughs> our chickens have decided to lay their eggs on the top shelf, which does not have a, a door access to the outside, which I think is kind of funny. So in the future, when we do have more chickens, I'm hoping they'll start to use the laying boxes with the actual doors. But for now, we just go on the inside to get the eggs. You can kind of see the wall of our house there, how close it is in proximity to our house and why I am not wanting roosters, at least at this time. All right, heading on in, I have hay on the ground there, and then I have their feeder that is hung up. I also have a water bucket that's hung up with chicken nipples on the bottom there, which I learned from a friend. They just go underneath and um, they can access the water that way, which is pretty cool. And then there's all their laying boxes. But like I said, they don't use the bottom ones where the doors are. They like to lay their eggs on top, usually all in the same nest. There's only about two places I've seen them lay eggs so far and they're on the top shelf. And then here's our broody hen. We already have a broody hen. She does have a couple of eggs under her and I'm just letting her be. One of the eggs might actually be fertilized and that's because she laid it the first day that she got here, but the other two definitely aren't fertilized. So I'll, I'll give you an update once I figure out what I'm doing with her. And then here is the chicken perch where they like to sleep at night. And in this corner here, I usually put some fresh greens plants from my garden or from my yard. 